Wright Brothers started in a garage. Amazon started in a garage. So you've probably seen the Cadillac commercial that touts all of the American businesses that, yes, have started in garages. And it's not just a history lesson. Every day, new businesses are starting in garages, including some right here in Arizona. Lon Myers knows a thing or two about starting a successful business in his garage. In fact, he's done it twice. And I never wanted to be an employee if I could avoid it. Myers launched his own clothing business, starting with one employee and one sewing machine. And I built the business up to I was doing close to $10 million a year. His first secret? Filling a need. That same secret has now worked for his second business, Lon's Shaving Secret. I determined that uh, I was sick and tired of paying the outrageous prices for razor blades. So Myers did some experimenting with a cosmetic base and found that he could save himself and others a lot of money by stopping the cause of dull blades. And the blade oxidizes. That's what metal does. That's what dulls the blade. Shaving has just about nothing to do with it. Meyer says that he can get one blade to last six months or more. You can't be plate glass shy, as they say. You gotta go where you think you can do some business. For Myers, that means selling at farmer's markets or specialty stores. You've gotta have the stomach for it because you're gonna have a lot more failures than successes. So by the way, okay, credit here, I never push any products ever. So I did the interview with Lons and sure enough, he said, Brandon, go ahead and give it a try. You use your Mach 4 razor, just go ahead and give it a try. I've been on the same blade for over a month now feels like the first shave. So credit where credit is due. And I told him I'd do that. Both men say, while yes, it can be chaotic starting your own business in a garage, they would not trade it for any other job, partly because they get to be their own boss. That's what he told me. More on their products on our website, azfamily.com.